gonna just keep coming back like cancer. Ah, uh, I'm fucking active. Oh. When you hear them ad libs, gang shit, and again, the man again, you're mad again. I went missing like Madeline, they thought I'd never rap again, but how about? No, bow down, ho, sticking round in your house with the fucking liquor out the own. And see, this is this is going into this is. He's back. He's on a different level than people. He's done moved on to a different chapter of what he's doing, not only in life, but apparently in his career as well. What is up, everybody? Welcome back to the Collective Beard Reactions. All right, so this is the final bit, the, the last, I don't know, 16 or 12 or so. No, how many? 15 songs on this with it. 11 songs, last 11 songs on this, so, um, I'm gonna tell you, this, this is just, this album is, it's, it's something else, it really is, uh, it, it's, just a, just a construction of it, and the way everything is done, I, I just, Anyways, here you go. All right, so this one right here is right back round. Sure you have no dreams, no hope You wake up and you're so broke No home, no friends, still I won't leave you Not until the score's equal I'm fighting pure evil with Got self-medication going on here This is, uh, wow Yeah, the reason why you can't sleep Like the, like the Tickling your nose and makes you want to sneeze it, It's, yeah, it, it Listen to uh, diazepam and other things that so it, this is again we're going to be back on the thing of uh pretty much the the dark side of things more the consequence you couldn't comprehend the wars i've seen the stories the horror scenes so what do i want to see you all deceased give new life a chance to restore some peace that was beauty before you tore to pieces you're living in hell killing yourself every day rape innocent girls women as well locking up innocent males for your skin color sitting in jail thrown in a cell over something as simple as cells risking your physical health to live in a digital world i disapprove of the I'm just going to say this. There's a couple songs on this album that have an element of organized insanity. And this is a perfect example of that. This is just... This is just absolutely... Definitely... Organized insanity. Exploring... It, that's taken and talking about it, it. it, it how do I put this it's another aspect of the darkness it's deep then because I love you so uh, you got the darkness you got darkness on this deep because I love you which is a bright spot so many lies darkness work working on yourself more light this right back round taking in how the, the bad stuff you do leads to more bad things and it just feeds a cycle and a lot of it being 
stuff that not either you've seen and experienced and it kind of leads to you know actions that you wind up doing and it kind of just feeds that cycle of darkness being yeah but with the way work and right back round have been the way they're organized it's like organized insanity or organized chaos almost in some portions of them hey, you hey. I can't be nice to you you ain't even nice to your own partner you watch your mum call twice and don't answer but that's what happens when you go out with no father and you expect my respect I guess you don't know calm And the end of this with a message, I say a message, it's basically like talking to a lover, talking about you don't, you know, you don't, res uh, you don't, how can I respect you when you don't respect me, you know, talking about having mom involved and stuff like that. It's just, there's, but with this and work, there's portions of it. The very first song of Eminem's first album, that bit of insanity, uh, like Eminem, if, oh, uh, and if you ever give it to him, you would even post, do it again, and then if he does it again, you probably hear him jumping out of something. It's that kind of like insanity level of, or it, it, insanity from the from the vocal. That's a kind of like same. I want to say it, it's, of course, the songs are different, but the same type of intensity. So it, it's it sounds like it's half screamed, and at the same point in time, right up underneath it with normal flow. So it's it's got this juxta juxtaposition of insanity, normal with normalcy, all at the same time being delivered. So it's again, this is another one of those. It's it's part of the darkness taking it, you know karmatic theme on this and also not only the uh, karmatic theme of you know what you what you do bad comes back around to you or what's been done to you come uh, comes back around to other uh, people it's also how the things that you do and, and some of the things that you experience take and kind of come right back around um, basically in more than one way so here we go the next one is painless so again i have a feeling it's going to be cycle light dark light dark light dark or dark light dark light dark light so here we go <laughs> I like the sound of this. Just right off the rip, I like the sound of this. Now, this is a shorter one, 2 minutes and 35 seconds. And that's two longer uh, songs. But this right here, I like the sound of this. It's back and I'm still somebody, you know. Never gonna kill somebody, catch somebody, bring somebody. Back to the matter and then stab somebody. Go back for more money, you know. And they say, you're not nobody till you help somebody. So, it, this is it, just an uplifting tone of this just from the first bit of it and that the, the first line so that's it tells you what you need to know you know i want to be painless i want to be pain free <laughs>
I like that. I really like that song. It, it's upbeat. It, it's part of the chorus. Everybody's got taken. Uh, I like that part in the chorus. Everybody's got a. I like that part. Everybody's got to heal their own way. So, you know, it, people have to, sometimes they've got to find that measure of healing internally for themselves. Uh, just the, the up, the, I like this. I really do. It's very sing-songy with the way it's done, <clears throat> but the message contained within is awesome. So, um, this is just so far. I mean, this is one, two, three, four, five, six, six songs in and they're all killer. Mama run away, no way I could do the same, oh no, no child, daddy's gonna break the cycle, and I'm a page for all summer all a day, just to see you smile, oh my dear child. So apparently this is to a little girl, his little girl, this is just, my daddy's got it taken. No way I could do the same. Oh no, no child. Daddy's gonna break the cycle. To my daddy's gotta break the cycle. That's just Yeah, th this is When you tell your child you gotta break the cycle and it doesn't matter what kind of cycle that is, it's an unhealthy cycle. Let's see what the rest of this song holds. And I'm a page for some all a day just to see you smile. Oh, my dear child. Little girl, two years you've been in the world. Don't want you to wonder why I've written this now. If there's one thing that I learned in this life, I might as to fight for yours. Because life is short and can become a living hell. Little girl, don't let him tell you that your daddy isn't well. He's threatening to kill himself. He's the villain and the criminal. I ain't innocent, but I ain't in a cell. I've done some toxic shit, your mother. Don't let him tell you, tell you that your daddy tried to kill himself. I'm not a criminal, but I'm not in a cell. Wow. Did as well. And if that's one thing I learned from her, never put another person first. Only person that you need to protect is yourself. <laughs> it's not selfish. The world is little girl. Listen up. This your song in case I ain't around to get in touch. In case you down, I'll set you up. You got me and bless your mum. Cause I got you. I'm begging you, never let anyone get the better of you. Be the best and watch the blessings come. That's less than one. Yeah. This book has never been closed. You will never be alone, cause I'll never leave. No, you were seven weeks old, three deep in a bed, still never leave. Bro, just know I try to fix a broken home and it broke me so. Mama run away. So this is a this is a letter in rap form to a daughter. Uh, apparently, it's a very toxic relationship. That's what I'm getting from this, and of course, you know, um, it, it's just. We've either all experienced or, or seen people or know people that experience toxic relationships. And sometimes children are involved and it's bad. And this is one of those things where it's like, you know, don't let anybody tell you that I'm an awful person. Because you, a lot of times, you know, the, the partner, once things have split, they try to take and demonize the other person in a relationship and also taking and, and telling the little girl, number one, I'll be, you know, I'll be here for, I, I'm here for you, but also look out for yourself. So. Just. Oh, 
You were seven weeks old, free deep in a bed, still never leave road. Just know I try to fix a broken home and it broke me so. Mama run away, no way I could do the same. Oh no, no child. Daddy's gonna break the cycle. Fill up my pants, for some all I did. Gonna lie, miss your mum, the little mug just split us up We had a run and it was fun apart from all the kicking off And getting locked out and she doesn't give a shit clock And now I've got a little girl, but got a lot of women problems What is it I'm gonna tell her when a fella is a wrong I know you like to see from one side when something goes rotten When you look at it from outside, it genuinely wasn't Looking something dead in a box, essentially it's a coffin When something's out of date, chuck the fruit away I was only your rage, my mother moved away Before that we saw so many stupid fights She had to do what's right, but I couldn't And do the same, not to you, not when I've been through the pain, my little girl, my baby in fact, daddy's little lady and that, you made me a man, who knows baby, maybe mum and dad will learn to forgive, maybe one day we could chat, that ain't any time soon, so I'm facing the facts, and just in case I don't make it to see another day, I'm making this track, basically saying no matter what, I ain't changing even though, this ain't what I planned, God made me a dad and I'm taking a stand. I'm raising you any way that I can Over phones, it's nothing they can do Cause they got no control I tried to fix a broken home But it broke me so I'ma run away No way I could do the same Oh no, no child Daddy's gonna break the cycle Fill up my pants For some holiday Just to see you smile Oh my dead child I'll never leave you Tuesday is a miserable world and I want you to know no matter what happens to me, I'll always love you. And no matter what, you'll always have yourself. So you will never be alone. And I'll always be a part of you. Trust. Sounds like it's uh, a dad to a to a daughter that you can't see. It sounds like uh, yeah, this is one of those ones where it's kind of like man. Things went south, and now that he doesn't have access to the child, but he's trying to let the child know, or at least not access to see the child. Tried taking and making things work with a mom, and it, it just about broke him. Toxic relationship. Just trying to take and tell the daughter, you know, I'll raise you any way I can. This is my letter to you in, in case things go sideways or south. It's just, man. All right, so for this go around, we got 
lost. So last one was little girl. This one's lost. Let's see how this, it's just been killer so far. Like it's just been straight up killer. Let's see if he continues with this. I don't see why it wouldn't. I look up to the sky and ask how long I live I don't wanna die, I got a lot to give I look up to the sky and ask how long I live I don't wanna die, I got a lot to give I look up to the sky and ask how long I have to live I don't wanna die, I have a lot to give I look up to the sky, two hands high and I pray liar, two fat lines in a late night, pray for my family's sake liar, pray that we gradually take flight. I look up to the sky, boy, if I ain't right, yeah. and if you ain't allowed to come and make my, yeah. and it's still class A to the day I die, no more serpents in the circle, not a family ain't the same size. And again, it's just absolute raw nerve, praying for his family. And dude, it, there's just emotion in, in the way he does songs. That's just, I don't know. It's almost, it's hard to say anybody else will be able to do the same thing. And see, in, the, in this, in the first verse, we get again the warning on letting in fake people. Because they just help you continue the cycle that's unhealthy for you. It just... <sighs> It sounded like there's a lot of reminiscing in that of childhood pains and struggles. Just the way everything's la laid out in this. It, it's It's one of those songs that it's just, I, I, this is one of those ones I have to take and digest a bit. It's, it's a lot of reminiscing. It's a lot of callbacks to sister and brother and, you know, it, and also I think probably the brother-in-law that was lost because it was different little references in here that I just, like I said, it's one of those ones I have to take and listen to again to, to, to fully digest, but it's just another one of those songs that's just, how? How does he do it? And this next one is called Endus Dunya. Now this one is featuring Logic, so can't wait to hear what this is going to sound like. Two just absolute killers on the track. Blood fire. Blood fire. Blood fire. Blood fire. I wanna fly away, find a place, hide away where I escape from this dunya da dunya dunya, dunya da dunya dunya. I wanna fly away, find a place. Okay, so I had to look up what dunya is, and it's it's, it's this world right here, this basically this life here, this earth, this world. Hide away. Right, 
last one Let me turn up Roll a fat one You're fucking with a bad one You want it, you can have some Max back song Captain of the ship, lift the anchor Try to write me off, but I'm on a different chapter They don't understand, I got another plan Think I'm gonna just keep coming back Like cancer Ugh, oh, I'm fucking active oh. When you hear them ad-libs, gang shit And again, the man again, you're mad again I went missing like Madeline They thought I'd never rap again But how about, no, bow down Ho, oh, sticking round in your house With the fucking liquor out the own And see, this is, this is going into This is He's back. He's on a different level than people. He's done moved on to a different chapter of what he's doing, not only in life, but apparently in his career as well. And people have wrote him off, but he, you know, this is letting them know, yeah, no, I'm still here. The world we're living in is a mess. Trump wants the East to go to war with the West. The real virus is the fear they're trying to pump in your chest. Speak it out, yeah, and it will. Wow, Trump's wanting the East to go to war with the West, and the real violence is the fear they pump in your chest. Holy crap. Yes, sir. You have the gist of it. Then there's no food for you. Don't get it twisted like a Rubik's Cube. No Tesco. Hey, let's go and rob a bank. But all the money's gone and credit cards are the new cash. You're still your halas. I'm not a part of the destruction. I'm teaching it. Uh, he's talking about some social and like economic just the ills that are happening and the way things have just kind of gotten messed up. He's trying to take and bring awareness and he's going to take and start a revolution to take and get people's minds where they need to be. I just try to rob the bank, but money's in the money's in the credit card. It's pla it's all plastic now. It's man. <laughs> They're they're tired of this and doing you this temporal world as they see it. One, hey, I'm here. I'm not. I'm not gone. I haven't lost anything. You about to take and see what I'm about. I've, I've pressed forward with things. I've got a plan. I've got an idea. You wrote me off, and that's just not the case. And on the other, you, you we've got to take and change how things are done. It's tired of the. Uh, Tired of the inequalities they see on this earth. So they're done with this. They're done with this world. But. In the sense of making it. How they want it to be. I like that. So we're going to skip over darkness. The next one is begged for. the voice the, the vocal on this it's beautiful it's 
melancholy. Um, it, it's somebody has wronged this person that that after begging for them, they they wanted them, and now they've done something to mess that completely up. I absolutely love this. Yeah, sometimes your heart won't let you rest till you set your pace. Not a relationship's that bitch, you can rest in peace. Yeah. Baby, I don't wanna get too deep, no, it's out the blue, but excuse me, I was trying to find asylum like a refugee, depending on you to rescue me. These times I was weak, I was running on empty belly. Just the way he comes into this and the way he goes about it, taking and talking to, talking to someone, and basically his, uh, his point of view, his gripes with the way things have went. Yeah. Baby, I don't want to get too deep. No, it's out the blue, but excuse me. I was trying to find asylum like a refugee. Dep I like that. I was trying to file a, find asylum like a refugee. Like, I, I look to you for, you are who I look to for, you know, for my safety. I keep you. Yeah, without good reason, why would you care what I have been for? So this is another one of those just, just the emotion that is brought forth because he's talking. This is to this is to, a, a, from all intents and purposes, to a female things you know, which that's been a theme in a couple of the songs. Things went south, but he, there's no hard feelings. It's just in the process of trying to take and basically save them and save himself he lost her and it's just a just the rawness of it the way it all comes forth is it's refreshing to hear and i don't care how many times you hear it like that because a lot of times you get which he's got work he got he does have word plays in this but a lot of times with the cleverness and you know a lot of times it's brought over either really really stuff like this and music is either brought over in like just a uh facetious fashion of like oh i've lost you and this is more like hey look this is you know this is the way i'm thinking this one and, and instead of taking and you know and, and it, he took and put it down to take and wrap it instead of actually putting it down for a letter or taking and coming like i said with something facetious just to take and oh i've lost a girl and blah 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 this is the, the personal nature and like raw nerve feeling you get from this stuff is just it makes it so much more honest sounding i think that's one of the things that's lost in music these days is honesty a scumbag i you all alone and you're calling me to come back Pfft, fuck that i'm too busy being a mic there will never be another me good luck trying to find one this has been a nice reminder and, uh... And of course, ending it with, you know, now you're begging for me and to hell with all that, you know, just due to everything that's been going through, there's no hard feelings, but apparently he'd rather not take and go through all that, all that kind of uh, jazz again, which from all indications from, you know, sounds like it was very toxic just from what he said in here. And yeah. The one you begged for. So this next one is called Run and Hide. I'm going to tell you, that, that begged for, I like that the female vocals on that were just absolutely, they were so beautiful. They were melancholy. And the juxtaposition between that and just the, the low-key personal nature of how Mike took and brought forth his part, it played really well together. It married surprising. It married very well together. So 
it's just that right there that that, that begged for might be I'm gonna tell you what so far that this album has let's see one two three four five six I'm gonna say seven standout tracks like and it's let's see one two three four five six seven so out of 11, seven of them are standout. The other four are just really, really solid. There's no filler in here. You don't, you don't ever hear that. So let's go ahead and hear run and hide. <laughs> I love the guitar on this. Life in the flesh, you fucking stay running hard. You done the crime, now you lay down and down in the pit. The society on the looking key in the jungle, made of concrete. Where you wanna eat, but you're dead. All my life, just suck my dick. Suck my dick, suck my dick, suck my dick. Okay, so apparently he's wanting somebody to suck him off. That's what I'm getting off of this so far, but he calls somebody a snake in the grass. So to me dating, I'm cutting off my old mates. Sad to see a grown man doesn't act his own age. Well, that girl a hoe, she'll probably suck it for some cocaine. And even got a no name. Don't phone me, you don't broke me, you don't back for the gang with a whole team. And I'm mad then, well, you're bad now. You want bad then, you get banged out. I'm mad then, ask Gren. Batter them with success, clash them with assets. It's as Woo! Wow. All right. Yeah, this one's um definitely different from the rest of them in the sense of... uh sounds like it's uh going after somebody on this he, he's calling out fake people he's going to take cut people out whether that's meant to them or somebody close to him that he had to let go or something like that it's just you don't back for the game life in the face you fucking stay running high that's the cry now you lay down and die in the face of society So, yeah, this one's, um, maybe there's some backstory I'm missing off of this. If somebody could let me know in the comments, it'd be greatly appreciated. Because it sounds like he's talking to some dude whose girl he might have screwed. And how the dude, he's calling the dude a, a snake in the grass. He needs to take and basically get rid of his woman because apparently he's already done her. But, uh, you know, it, it was apparently retaliation for something, so. All right. Well, that one stands out but for a totally different reason. I'm not going to say I, I, I dislike that one at all. Because once you get past the sophomore suck my dick. It's got a message to it. To somebody. Um, but th the flow on it. Just. Another solid tune. That's for sure. So this next one is called Stay Alive. Drowning again, down in the depths of the doubt in my head. Hey, I'm drowning again. Can we make it out the ends? I'm fucking now. Yeah, hey. Hey. stay alive. Stay alive. Ooh, hey. stay alive. Stay alive. Ooh, hey. stay alive. Guess I'm out on my death, now I'm doubting my strength The more that you ignore the doubt, the louder it gets in Don't you dare take that crown off your head No, how when I'm a scrounge or a beg Council housing until we make it out of the end I'll be out here again, I'll be out here again Yeah, tryna stay alive, tryna stay alive Everything we 
in south here, no Opportunities round here, so Usually we drown here, yo Only a few get out here, don't Wait for change, you gotta make a change You gotta bunk a train, you gotta take a risk You gotta break a chain, you have to open the door You can't just make a witch, you can't just break the ditch You can't just make a hit, you have to take a step That's what making it is Get out where you're putting up, you're taking it in I So I'm noticing something too Because this, this album has been like Like the first four or five songs It was like light, dark, light, dark, light, dark Like the middle bit has been was more of redemption type stuff and then you've got the last three songs where it's more he's coming out it's this is who he is and he's making he he's doing what he's got to do to make the change for the better and stay alive is another example of that so he's taking and you know taking and ignoring your doubts it'll eat you alive but if you're taking you know doing what he can to, to make sure he stays alive it just it's like this whole album is is one big theme of a cycle and there's multiple cycles within the overall cycle it leads to the breaking the end up I was down in the press out, I'm a death drowning, I could have bowed down to the doubt and my head lost the power now I found it again till I make it out of ends of yacht here Drown it again Down in the death Sit it down in my head And this is fighting against your doubts to, you know, if you feed a doubt, you'll definitely take and be, you'll never take and be able to do anything. Can't ignore it because eventually it'll take and well up and overtake you. But if, if you fight against it, you at least have a, you can at least take a rise over those doubts and keep yourself above water some. Fuck it out here again. Just another day, another existential crisis Come step inside this mind and see life from my angle Though I try to be thankful everywhere I look I see guys getting trampled, bombs getting dropped It's not gonna stop How can I care who's top of the pops? I don't wanna be lost Everybody's fighting a battle but it's deeper than just mine You gotta see for the rough times Cause soon you'll be doing just fine Had days I prayed I would have wake set straight I ain't busy trying to seem like a tough guy I was lost in my head Hopped in a jet then I went globe trotting instead Saw poverty then I saw happiness Now what if it's next I don't wanna be dead Me and Blaze on a mission Yeah there been days that I prayed it was different I ain't living in a mix no more Could he pricks go tour so it pays to be distant I can never just go with the flow When I saw that the glow's full of hate and resistance We ain't strapped in the chains but it's facts that Man a roof full blow stays to addiction I've been down to the dumps like Stig was Browse in my gut, loud in my blood that I Now I don't know if there's somebody else featured on this But the flow, killer And he's talking about the different things that he's seen and how it's how it is in his head and how it yeah it, it's dude just mm. sometimes you hear stuff and it's just the way you want to express it doesn't quite come out i know what he's i know what he's saying but for me to express it must for me to take and explain it the way i'm the way it's coming the way it's processing in my head is completely you know not easy for me to take and get. I, I, I try not to take and get too hung up on words. What he's seeing, being in it, it, the in the different things he's seen, the inequalities and stuff like that, the way it plays in his head, the way it takes and the way it does things in his uh, that's already there with his head, and having to take and fight against that, he took and instead of dealing with it, did jet set and basically taking you know run, tried running away from what he was seeing, and it it's everywhere. And there we go. That was stay alive and just it's about fighting, the, fighting against your doubts and the things that you see and the things that are in your head that just kind of can hold you down. And doing that to take and stay alive, take and stay basically stay sane in your within your own own head. Now this next one, I'm guessing it's pronounced uh, Margotti. So Margotti boy. Yeah, this next one, Margotti boy, I'm guessing. Um, did a real quick Google search. Apparently it's a town in England. 
on the coast. inside I have my pain inside I find a place and hide Hey yo big bro, look up what you did big bro I hope you're somewhere listening to this big bro It's like a dream, can't believe that you're dead big bro Can't believe we're never getting lean again big bro Both know you wasn't mentally ill big bro Can't get into politics but still big bro I don't wanna tarnish anything you built big bro Want a real big bro, that's a real shit show That baby bump big and your baby mum's pissed Look what you left the family to deal with bro Holding hands with her So I'm guessing this is in reference to the brother-in-law that took his life. Uh, this sounds like it's coming from a place of anger, which one of the stages of grief and grieving is anger. Bro, you're gonna be missed like a real big bro. It feels like a fucked up film, big bro. I remember that cool. I was already stressed and my sis takes telling me you're missing. I'm upset. You said you wasn't going back again, but we're back here again. And that's... Be honest, this is kind of hard to hear. Just because of knowing the, uh, you know, what kind of inspired the album. And uh, this being, this sounds very, very personal. Um, yeah, that was hard to kind of listen to, actually. That was, S sounds like something born out of pain and anger and confusion. Hard for anybody to have to take and go through something like that. Just... I try to stop these songs two or three times as they go through. I try to let them breathe some. I try to let them take and I try to stop them two or three times, give my thoughts on, on stuff that I hear that kind of strikes me or what I'm thinking about the direction the song is going. I couldn't do that with this one. That that I felt like it would almost be disrespectful to stop past just the one point that I did. It really did. How are you going to take and comment on somebody else's feelings towards something, a tragedy that has happened? How? The so last song on this is called Suicide. So just went ahead and take a listen to that. Um, this song right here is just too real. This one's for you, Mike Righteous, or should I say Mike Reckless? Um, obviously, I don't know if you recognize the hat. Yeah, that's uh, this is mine now because it suits me. And um, if you're wondering why I've taken it, I took it from Farzad's house when I had to do his bathroom. And uh, it's for all the boxes and socks that never got returned. Alright, mate? Funny that. Cheers, rocks. Boxes and socks. Suicide for my friends. Come outside, hide from the ends. Oh, yeah. Wasn't there. Horrified. I was scared. Suicide for my friends, come outside, hide from the ends. Oh yeah, I wasn't there, horrified, I was scared. And no place Time I see something you touch, I stop and stare And get this weird feeling of comfort Just because you touched it And I might be fucked up But man, it's something I want to share Yeah I'm still wearing your joggers It got tearing I remember swearing I never stole them But I was joking So this is 
this is sounds like it's the after effects from the suicide of just you see the person and everything. Sick of the cycle, but ain't safe outside. I'm sick of life, but I can't contemplate my suicide for my friends. Come my side, hide from the ends. This song right here, I think, is just a subject matter contained within it. Because he, he, he's tired of wearing a suit from his friends that have died, from burying friends that have died. He can contemplate his own life, but he's not going to be contemplating suicide. That's... And there we have it, Suicide. It's just another, I'm telling you, this, the album as a whole is a classic. It's an instant classic. It's a masterpiece. There are, I'm going to say, eight, ten standout songs on it. Everything else is just absolutely, it's, it's solid enough to be, not it's not filler so it's it's not like it's just fluff stuff that's in this this is all personal this is all raw this is all self-reflective and it's like there's a cycle contained within the cycle and i think the last two songs kind of break that as they're talking about it and like it's really really it's almost like it's really the first the first you know margate boy the last two are almost a cycle in and of themselves. One is just pain, hurt, you know, pain, anger, confusion, and the last song, Suicide, in and of itself is kind of reflective ex acceptance and determination at the same time. This album is just hands down one of the better albums I've heard any genre um eclectic beard eclectic beard reactions eclectic it's varied many likes you got a very you don't have just tied into one thing when it comes to music i grew up on country and pop i listen i love listening to rock music actually if you take a look two most listened to or two main at least right now Playlist I've got when I take and do listen to music while I'm gaming or something like that. It's pop punk from the 90s and the 2000s, and it's grime music now. But for the longest time, my go to was stuff like My Chemical Romance and The Used and Green Day, Sum 41, stuff like that, and a lot of other stuff that just one hit wonder type stuff and everything like that but still within the pop punk genre this right here i don't care if it's country i don't care if it's blues i don't care if it's jazz and which as far as jazz concerned yes i love jazz um hip-hop doesn't, ma doesn't matter what the genre it is it's one of the best albums i've heard so i'd give it a 10 out of 10 or 5 out of 5 10 out of 10 100 out of 100 whatever you want to take and give it it's just absolute from start to finish, it's hard to take and beat this album. It really is. Um, that being said, let me know in the comments what you think of this album. What are the standout songs for you? Because I'm going to tell you right now, I think the standout songs for me would be uh, It's Deep, Because I Love You, Work, Painless, Little Girl, and this uh, Dunya, Darkness, Begged For, Margate Boy, suicide i mean it's just those are just absolute standout you hear them and you're like holy crap even run and hide is a standout kind of a different reasons but it still stands out just for the uh the uh request for Felacio that he takes and gives on it you know the the, the 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 wanting people to uh blow his whistle um so to speak um but even even within that you take that and just 
look at the take that out you take a look at the flow and the beat and everything it still stands out on its own um begged for one of the prettiest most melancholy just beautiful all the way through so thanks for watching if you like what you see like subscribe and notification bell y'all have a lovely one peace